Hello, hello, hello. How are you guys doing? Thank you guys so much for joining Tierra's Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking on to my video. This video will be for my beautiful and my handsome Virgos out there. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Now keep in mind it's a general reading, so it's not going to resonate with everyone. So please take the part that does, but doesn't leave that shit on out. Okay. And also this could be the past, the present, or in the future, okay? Let's go ahead and get started here. Gem uh, I'm about to say Gemini. Some of you could be dealing with a Gemini. I do see air here. But uh, Virgo, let me let me say this. Let me say this. Let me say this. Let me say this, boo. I'm getting somebody's obsessed. Obsessed with like ending you. Obsessed with your happiness. Obsessed with the fact that you're happy. You're, you're loved. And, you know, you have everything that it is that you need. Somebody's obsessed with trying to end something within your life. Okay, they want that they want that smile and that smirk to come off your motherfucking face. Okay? Somebody is so obsessed. They just mad at the fact that you're smiling out here, Virgo. Baby, you better give him that motherfucking Kodak goddamn smile and keep on pushing, boo. Because somebody was really, really they don't like the fact that you're happy. Um, for others of y'all, this could be a Queen of Cups energy. She could be a um, Cancer Pisces or Scorpio or what have you. But this bitch is mad and obsessed with the fact that you're happy. Or this Gemini, this ex, I don't know whoever this person is. Somebody in your life is obsessed. They they don't like the fact they get a they get like a, a thrive and a thrill off of making you unhappy, off of seeing you sad, off of seeing you mad and depressed and shit like that. So now that you're in a good mood, you're you're feeling better or some of y'all y'all could be going through your own thing. Okay, you know you got enemies in the background, but it's like you won't let them see you sweat, I should say. Because you know that they get a thrive and a push and a kick out of seeing you down. You get what I'm saying? So because like, ugh, like I don't know, I don't like this type of energy. I don't know why people is like this or what have you. Bitch, find you something to do. Hope get a job, wash that ass. Somebody get a job, wash their motherfucking ass. Bitch, wash your ass. Okay, some people worried about you. Yeah, they so worried about your happiness here with the sun card. Okay, yeah, some of you definitely can have fire in your chart. Okay, or you just a boss, and that's just period. Def this is some strong Leo energy. So some of you could be a boss. Okay, you gotta definitely have Leo in your chart. You gotta leave your chart. Go look at, at that video. Okay, but um, yeah, somebody wants you heartbroken. Somebody wants you in a three of swords energy, or this person, or this Leo could be, um, or uh, Leo Sagittarius or Aries could be heartbroken at this time. Okay, let's see. Or somebody's mad at you, a boss. Somebody thought that they had, you know, a hold on you or something of that nature. Okay, somebody's mad at the fact that you are a magician. Okay, you can manifest anything that you want at this time. Create anything in your life. Okay, so somebody's mad. So they're trying to burden you on purpose. Like, the fuck? Look at that. Come on, baby. You have fortune and favor, baby. You have luck. You are blessed. Somebody's jealous of your blessing. Somebody's jealous of the anointed. You ain't got to have shit to your fucking name. When it comes to your spirit, your soul, your anointing, people can't stand it. Okay, they want to see you hurt. They want to see you in pain because they get a kick out of it because they ain't shit. They codependent. They on drugs. They are alcoholic. Okay? They bound to a situation they don't want to be in. And for others of y'all, somebody that's simply jealous of your fucking relationship with the five of wands to the two of cups. They jealous of your motherfucking relationship. People is crazy out here in these streets. I can't make it up. Some of you could definitely be dealing with a tourist, but you're in a relationship, you're in a marriage or a high level of commitment, high level of commitment with the added coins, okay? And somebody's jealous of that shit. Somebody's jealous as hell, Virgo, okay? They, so they, they have a thrive, but they want to they wanna, they wanna see if they can, like, break you guys apart or stop you from um, being happy here, okay? Wow, Virgo. Look at this, Queen of Pentacles and the Six of Cups. Okay, so you could be definitely dealing with a past life soulmate. Okay, or you just simply a motherfucking boss or entrepreneur. You got your own shit going on, okay? This could be somebody from your childhood, somebody that you know from your childhood confirmation. Okay, yeah, here you go, Virgo. But you you stay to yourself. You mind your business. You don't really fuck with nobody, deal with nobody like that. You know that there's a lot of haters out here. And you know the more you climb up the ladder, it's going to be another devil. New level, new devil, okay, is what I'm getting. Yeah, King of Swords. So we got somebody here that's cold, ruthless, okay, one, trying to win at all costs, 
Okay, yeah, this person is coming in fast with the Knight of Swords. Damn, these cards acting crazy. Thinking that they can offer you something or seeing that they can... I don't know. This, per this person is definitely going to be coming in, trying to act if everything is all cool, act like they didn't do you how they did you, or act like, you know, but their intentions is bad here, okay? Okay, this person even might try to apologize to try to get in your good gracious. But it's like you're taking action within some type of marriage, some type of, uh, wow, your intuition is on point here, Virgo. So somebody needs to stop fucking playing with you. Because it's like you can you can smell and see this person a mile away, all right? Like, come on now, what the fuck is wrong with them? We got the Nine of Pentacles. Some some of you are single, all right? Um, or you're just very independent. Whether you're with someone or not, you're an independent motherfucker. Okay, you're forced to be reckoned with, all right? We have the Ace of Pentacles. You're going toward this new beginning, all right? In this period, you're moving forward with the uh, Cancer card. I mean, Chariot card, Cancer energy. Man, wow. Virgo, we have the Empress, baby. Oh my gosh, my goddess, my god. Whoa. <laughs> Ten. Y'all be there gonna be short because I don't need to, I don't need to go no further. Okay, we got the Empress. First of all, we got the Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. So somebody cannot stop what's meant for you, what you manifested. So they want to see a frown on your face, baby. The only frown you're going to have on your face, baby, or mad about is what the fuck you're going to eat tonight. You're going to be confused about what the fuck piece of chicken you're going to get, bitch, or whatever the hell. You ain't worried about nothing about somebody else trying to do, okay? But this person was obsessed with trying to, trying to um, stop this shit. Okay, they was obsessed with trying to end you, but they can't. All they can do is watch you here with the page of swords. All this person can do is watch you and stand the fuck by. Okay, yeah, baby, your instance told you to move the fuck on, and that's what you did. All right, you got away from whatever this is. So, it's, wow, towards new love, I can't make it up. You went towards new love, new happiness, new. <laughs> New partnerships, okay? Soul tribes in this fucking thing. All right? You're not worried about somebody from your past here. Tower moment. Wow. What else I see that came out for my Virgos? What's a tower? Wow. This shit them blew up in their motherfucking face, Virgo. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh, but hey, you keep playing with fire, baby. You're going to get burned. Like, that's just the way it go. Like, okay, but this shit, it blew up in their motherfucking face. Look at this Tower to the World card. Then we got a Judgment card. God himself came down and fucked this motherfucker up. God himself <laughs> came down, okay, and said, not my baby, not today. What the fuck is you doing? I see, I see what you do. What the fuck are you doing? This person over here, mind their business, living their life. Okay, this is this is my golden child. This is my baby. What the fuck are you doing? Oh, oh, you you tried it? Okay, I got something for your stupid ass. Okay, God came down and got that motherfucking ass. Because regardless, you're going to be happy. You're going to have that smile on your motherfucking face. And that's period. <laughs> Whatever type of action it was, they're going to be left out in the cold. This motherfucker might even end up homeless or already the fuck is. A lot of people in their life are walking away from them. So there are going to be people in their life that's going to walk away from the, from this person, okay? They don't want nothing to do with this individual. Why you over here about to get this nine of cups, nine of cups, this offer, this proposal, whatever, okay? Period. Mm. God don't like ugly. That's all I'm going to say. God don't like ugly with their stupid asses, okay? Virgo, I think I'm going to end it there, okay? It could have been a, a, a father figure, a boss, or whoever the fuck this was. Okay, not a sword, not this person is conflicted. They have a nightmare. They can't even fucking sleep. No rest for the wicked. And that's just period. No rest for the motherfucking wicked. No rest for the wicked. This friend or um this ex lover, whoever this is that was trying to uh end whatever this is in your life, try to do some magic or whatever they were trying, however, whatever tactic that they were using to try to bring you down. <laughs> That shit and came to a motherfucking end. Their life will be slow. They will be in poverty for years to come. They will be begging other folks to help them financially. Why you over here a whole motherfucking boss? 
Yeah, don't play with God's people. I try to tell people all the time, don't mess with me. I remember a couple of people that I know that did me dirty. Ex, what have you, family members that did me dirty. I told them not to fuck with me. And they did anyway. And they asked us, are we they, they, I mean, these some of them just talked about me. They just talked about me, okay? Others of them teamed up with other people, my exes and shit like that or whatever. And um, they, they got in car accidents, they money, they thought they were saving, damn, they, they, they got hit in their savings accounts, all that shit. Like, some of them either, even ended up homeless fucking with me. So I tried to warn these stupid asses. Even when some got the warning, they still didn't stop because they were just so jealous. They just wanted to really end me. But look at their asses now. That's all I got to say. So these people looking stupid, they looking dumb. Okay, Virgo? <laughs> I'm here, look at me now. Look at me now. Hey. You get in paper. And that's period. That's period point blank. Virgo, you guys need anything from me? Look in the description box below for a personal reading. Okay. If you want to ask me one or two questions, you'd like donate to my channel or add me on Instagram. I love you guys so freaking much. I will see you guys in the next reading. Bye.